My name is Natalie Lanise. I am from Cleveland, Ohio. I have been living in Toledo for the last two years, and I make very large-scale, brightly colored mixed-media installations. I moved to Toledo two years ago after I was hired as painting and drawing professor at Siena Heights University in Adrian. I lived in Brooklyn, New York for seven years before I moved here and I moved there for graduate school and continued working as an artist uh, for five years after that. And um, New York is uh, fast paced and competitive just as everyone imagines it being. Um, but after a while I just wanted to be in a slower paced environment, um, in a more affordable environment, and I was really looking forward to coming back to Ohio for those reasons. Um, and I found Toledo um, to not only be both of those things, but a pretty dynamic art community as well. For my most recent project, it was a show that I uh, installed in Cleveland, I began to think uh, more specifically about how painting relates to the architecture of a space. And so in that context, I really wanted to treat the gallery space as a set or a theater um, for viewers to both look at it from a fixed point, um, but also to walk into it and enter into this space that I essentially just created with color and pattern and begin to experience or perceive the interior architecture in a completely different way. Well, humor is just important to me in my life, um, and therefore it's very important to my work, um, mostly for the reason that I want my work to be accessible to anybody. Um, that was always my goal while I was in graduate school and in most of the work since I've made since then, that um, both my five-year-old niece and my graduate school professor can approach the work and enjoy it on some level. Well, I think I had a pretty normal American childhood and that's definitely something that um, you know comes back a lot uh, in my work. I mean nostalgia is a huge part of what I do. Um, I think you know using nostalgia allows people to kind of connect with the work on like kind of a warm level, you know? They connect with me their own memories. Um, and so it's sort of my way to kind of pull someone in, really maybe think about what our culture has, um, I don't know, built us up to be as adults. And um, it's eventually commented on it in some level. Um, some pieces are, maybe a little more of a social commentary than others, but there's always kind of that critique in, it, in the work in some way.